Hey guys, it's Jackie. So, um, I figured, um, before it gets too cold, um, I'd start trying to get some more, um, shooting done with my bow. And, um, I kind of got a few things going on. They're, they're kind of like, well, they're sort of like product reviews. They're also kind of like, sort of field tests, I guess you could say. Um, but anyway, I know like with, archery particularly when we're talking about the uh, western like mediterranean split finger and three under um those are uh the most common you know type of techniques for um drawing the bow back and i've kind of you know through my first year coming up um i've kind of tried several different techniques. I've tried the split finger and that's kind of what I normally do and I did try three under but just I figured you know you know split finger kind of works better for me at least uh, but I decided you know maybe I could try doing three under again and I actually have products to do that and kind of just compare how they feel and kind of how my groupings are whenever I make my shots and if you can see on my beanie here, that's Shadowproof Archery, and that's kind of, you know, sort of a product placement there, forgive me. But, um, so it's kind of a review of some of their products. I'm going to be reviewing kind of, I guess, their um, finger tab here. Um, these can be trimmed, which I already have, and... This will probably be kind of a two-parter. I'm going to try, you know, shooting nothing but three fingers under. And then maybe for the next video, I'll try the um, split finger tab and, you know, kind of see how that goes and kind of review that. I also have other products here. Um, I have uh, Shatterproof Archery uh, Arm Guard. And I'm just going to try that out and see if, see if I like it. Um, so far, it, it fits pretty well. It's definitely got a much more simpler design here. It's, you know, you kind of just fasten it on. You kind of got the hooks there and you got the uh, bungee cord kind of thing. And it's just seems very simple. Um, I, have an, I have another one kind of similar to this, but it has like two sets of the bungee cords which goes around here and then kind of over like that and it's like you know it's fine but I just thought I'd give this a test and obviously test out this uh, three under finger tab it's um, made of uh, I guess chrome tan chrome tan leather is what it's called and so I'm just gonna try that out gonna kind of show how some of my groupings are and you know see how I like it so anyway I'm gonna stop topic stop talking and get to shooting all right so I've got a target at um, about 10 yards or so so you know I'm going to be again trying three fingers with this tab from uh, Shadowproof Archery and just see how it feels couple times and there we All right, let's see how we did here. All right, 
right, so I was kind of aiming for that um, discoloration there. You know, it's kind of a dark spot, and uh, as you can see, I got some pretty close to there, and some of them veered off. And obviously, the arrows that went lower are kind of, you know, probably either didn't draw back far enough, or um, maybe I referenced, you know, my arrows a little too low, but. Um, I'll just take a few more shots and we'll see how it goes. Some are low and some are a little high. Yeah. But I'll take a look at that. Got a seriously tight group there.
So yeah, I kind of had to uh, pack up because it's it started to rain here. Um, but yeah, that was pretty tight groupings in the last bit. So yeah, um, this um, three under chrome tan finger tab from Shatterproof Archery, it's actually pretty good. It definitely did good to protect my fingers. I could kind of sort of feel the string a little bit, but you know, wasn't like painful or anything. It really, it really does its job. Um, and yeah, as I said before, I'm not really too used to, uh, shooting three under. So, um, yeah, I, I definitely recommend, you know, if you're want, uh, you know, good, fairly good quality, uh, archery equipment. Um, I also think this arm guard performed very well too. It's actually lighter weight than my other one. And, um, yeah, it's just, it's a lot simpler. And what I really do like about this, um, arm guard here is that unlike my other one, um, you see they have like Obviously, you know, extra padding in the middle there, which is what is supposed to be for the protection. But then there's these two ones that are kind of wrapped around it. That's like the soft, smooth part of the leather. And that's going to be on your arm. And it's the same on the outside that's supposed to be guarding it. And this one here from, um, I think it's SAS, Southland Archery Supply. You know, it's got the hard leather there and obviously there's some extra padding there for more protection but on the inside it's got this kind of sort of rougher you know material I mean it's kind of like what we have in between these tabs here and that's like on my arm whenever I have it but this yeah this one I definitely like better it's just Here's the bungee cord straps. You can kind of tie them and, you know, loosen them, tighten them, whatever you need. Um, but I think it was, this is exactly how it came in the mail and it fits fine, at least with my, uh, my jacket on. So, you know, but yeah, that might change and, you know, the, when it gets warmer, which is not going to happen for a long time, of course. Uh, but yeah, it, you know, I might have to adjust it now and every now and again. And but yeah, I definitely like that, and I think this is pretty good. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and try to uh, <clears throat> see about um, testing out the um, the split finger version of this, and um, I'll probably link some videos to some of Shadowproof Archery's stuff or. Uh, Kramer Ammons, who actually started the company, um, he has some videos, especially when it comes to these um, tabs and all the other gear. He actually does have a um, kind of a, a, a video for like tips on how to trim this because, you know, he'll he'll explain, you know, the whole trimming thing so that it fits right to where you need the protection and it's not excess material that's you know, interfering with the string, throwing your shot off. But anyway, those are my thoughts on these products. They're very good. Uh, so anyway, thank you all for watching and I'll catch you next time.